A rock band made up of middle school students from the Project School just released its first album on the streaming site Bandcamp. Ethan Sandweiss and Devin Ridgway joined Youth Revolution at its end of year concert Monday. Ever since I was really little and I had a tiny microphone, I've always wanted to like become some kind of person that like people listen to and like know. And so it feels really nice that that's finally come true. Mr. Matt just basically got a bunch of kids together and they would play music. It was originally strings, so like guitars and ukulele, but it evolved to become more than that. I'm super proud of this album. I've never really heard anything like it from kids this age. Uh, like I grew up in concert bands and stuff and there's an adult standing above you waving their arms and you're reading music on a stand and this is more like visceral. It's uh, they write the songs, they learn how to jam. <laughs> One of the first songs I wrote for Jam Session, like Youth Revolution, was The Last Time. Um, I wrote that about my biological father, who had recently passed away at the time. Just being in Jam Session was a safe place where I can just like let all my feelings out. Mr. Matt is a really awesome dude for like making that happen. Personally for me, since he's a guitar player, he's helped me like um, with developing solos and that sort of stuff. He's really helped me along the, along the journey. I don't think there's anything like this <laughs> uh, in America. Like, I know there's like little rock bands and stuff, but uh, the way they like work together, write songs together, arranging uh, the kind of professional recording we put out, I feel pretty unique. Just being like 13, all of us are, I think, um, and releasing an album that anyone can listen to at any time is very cool. Uh, also, just playing music in general I think is fun. And it's something that could last forever if they want to keep playing. I can trust them and like know that they're not going to judge me about my lyrics or like my voice. I don't really know what my career is, but I know it's going to involve music in some way.